Hi, boys and girls. How are you? How's your day going? Mine went really well. I ended up in a thrifty store. And as a lot of you know, I love the thrifty stores. Churches, yard sales, Goodwill, Salvation Army. The money all goes to good places. Um, whether it's charity or helping other people get to work, um, having jobs and all that stuff. Meanwhile, I'm just a broke bitch and love finding a good deal. I found Lucky Brand, Aristotle, however you say that, you know, Ed Hardy, Jordache, maybe that dates me or something, I don't know, but I find all sorts of stuff. And even if you think about Wrangler, they're like $45 a piece. So when I find them for a buck, I'm really, really happy. Um, Hollister, Old Navy, Juicy Couture, they're all in these stores. Women donate to them all the time. And for the most part, I get great deals on it. Every now and then, a word to the wise that some people go and find an item and they're going online and they're checking for it and they go to eBay and eBay might have something like this marked at $3,000. That just means some fool posted it up there for $3,000. It's worth 13 cents. But my point is, just because it's online for sale that much doesn't mean anybody bought it for that much. So save your three cents. It wasn't sold. It wasn't bought. It's just up on the internet. So come along with me and see what I got for pennies. For pennies. I like dollars. You know I love the five below people, but this can't be beat. So let's go with this piece. I love this piece. I'm going up to Minnesota and underneath of a black jacket. This is going to be great. Okay. We got a great aqua blue. And it's short sleeve, very satiny, nice buttons, nice big black buttons. That's why I think it'll go with a lot of my black jackets. Okay, and this is the back. And this is by JR Knights. You can see the tailoring and the collar. And like I said, I'll be going to Minnesota with this. And what this piece is, is from a set. I would guess that it's from a bridesmaid's set because it is a little over the top, a little bit. I can't see wearing it many regular places, but it's, it's fancy. It's fancy. And putting it on with a pair of jeans and a black jacket is going to be so cool. So what, ooh, I knocked my camera around. What did I pay for this? Satin, double lined. Made by a name tailor that I didn't research yet. In perfect condition. It was 10. I got it for two. Isn't that great? For two dollars. And like I said, it's probably a piece from a bridesmaid or a mother of the bride outfit. It it's nice. And I love the color. I hope you get the guys get the color right. Okay, let's see what's next on my haul. Okay, this is a cute one. See, I'll read it to you. My little baby, you've come a long way. And it's like an infinity heart. Great big t-shirt. I could uh, sleep in it. Work with it. Oh, and this says big baby. I've never had these before. The little crunchy sides. I'm not doing very well in this at all. But I'll prove my point eventually. And that goes up the sides. I think that might just stay in the house. I don't know. But it looks comfy. And what was this? What's this? One dollar. One dollar. And I'm not making this up. Not everybody's one dollar. The store I went into today has plenty of full price stuff, which is still discounted. Um, jeans, there would be six dollars as opposed to a dollar here there. You have to search these things out. You have to do your research. Just blindly paying a dollar for something is great. But if there's something that you see at a store, go research it a little bit and find out if the price that they are using is compatible with your budget. Because, again, they're thrifty stores. Okay, what else? Okay, this is super cute. Super cute. I love this. This is by Marlid. I don't know who that is. So we've got this great sweater. Real cute. 
It's freezing in New Jersey. We got white, gray, black, red, all my favorite colors. But, I'm going to get used to this soon. I keep knocking y'all around. It's got bell sleeves. I, you know I love me some bell sleeves. And that was $2. Now, some of these are priced at $2. Some of them have been marked down, but it's still $2. Let's see. Then I got, let's see what this is. Oh, I know what this is. This is for an ASMR show I have, or like I try to have. I'm always trying something new. And this is a little vase, maybe one of those at, you know, atomizers, but this is what I'm doing with them. And you can see that on Sea Monster 1970. Actually, that's what you should be seeing here now is Sea Monster 1970. And if you are in here watching this, go down there. Let me study you. Go down there and do the subscribe. And then if you subscribe, I think you got to do a bell. You hit the bell and you can find out the next time I post a video. And then I will be a lot happier. I've got 35. I'd like to make 40 soon. I'm working on it hard. Okay, so let's see what else we got. My chocolate milk that I did not. I thought I threw it away. This can be bought for $1.29 at your local Wawa. That is backwards. So turn around and you'll be able to see this. That's the best chocolate milk in the world. So let's see what else is in here. Okay, what is this? It looks like paper for the cat. Oh, no, I know what this is. This, I paid a few extra dollars because it's going to go in this room behind me. And if you haven't seen it yet... Yeah, it's kind of like a prince room. We call it Mr. Rogers' room. We do a lot of stuff back here. Um, we do Lady Date. And if you want to know more about Lady Date, put the question down there below. It sort of looks like I'm pointing to my JJ, but it's not. Do the stuff b below, okay? This, my hubby got me. Isn't it creepy? There's a piano. More piano. And when the time comes, that'll sound really cool. But that is going in here. We already have one in here, so I'm going to put another one in here later on. That was $2 as well. And I remember in high school, I had to collect all of them. And my mom gave a fit because it was expensive back then. Okay, so let's see what else I got. Oh, okay. I got this. RuPaul. And it's not so, I mean, I love me some RuPaul. Okay, but I wanted to prove that you can get anything if you just watch. He's on Vanity Fair. She, I don't know if you know who RuPaul is. I love him, love him, love him on Vanity Fair. And it's no different. It's no different whatsoever, but it was on a 25 cent rack. This, this damn magazine is something like $17 and it's the 1920, 2019-2020 edition for 25 cents. Now, what's pretty cool about that is it's got more than $3 worth of perfume little thingies. Guarantee you. I'm almost at the edge of my bag, which means that'll be it for us right now. I got, I thought this was just so cute. It's a little lizard gecko and it doesn't have a price that I can get on for you right now. I think it says $12. I'm not sure. But that little red mark means it was a quarter. A quarter. Just like the quarter I spent for the Vanity Fair thing. Little undernight shirty. At night. Late at night. Too big for anything else. This was a dollar. Little cutie thing. No big deal. None of it's any great big deal because I like to go and buy epic pieces. <coughs> Pardon me. But every now and then, I just got to break down and get some around the house stuff. And, uh, yeah, I thought this looked like the, uh, little gecko thing. And that, too, was a dollar. And that's by, I don't know, it looks like some snail people. 
And the designs, I really don't care about. I just find it interesting that somebody could charge $35 for an item and then I can go pick it up for a dollar. Let's see. And a bracelet. This is a little pricey, but it sort of has the Hermes look to it. Matter of fact, I'll take it off and let you see it better. It's black. It's gold. It's got the Hermes look to it. It snaps. Ta-da! So that's basically about it. I don't know any other way to do these hauls. But I did do um, a whole bunch of smushy, crocky things. And that's another video that's already been posted. And so that's pretty much it. That was today's haul. I spent under 20 bucks for four pieces of clothing, two pieces of jewelry, um, and a couple little odds and ends. That's really cool. Learn from that. Dollar Tree, Goodwill, anywhere. This was called the Etc. Shop because they have other things other than clothes. Etc. You get it? Okay. So, thank you. And maybe um, I'll do another haul with something else. Like food again or something. I've done food. So, uh, yeah, right down below. And maybe I'll give you a shout out and do it anyway. Your idea. Ta -da. Okay, thank you. I always need feedback. That's it. So you have a good day tomorrow because it's nighttime tonight.